<laughs> Welcome to Canon Culture, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, oh, the the most consistently inconsistent podcast out there. Uh, entertainment commentary at its finest. I'm here with all my co-hosts today, and we also have a very special guest. Uh, you guys know Deacon, Mr. Downbag, Coochie, DJ San, and of course Plank, and of course my man. He decided to join us today and turn on his camera. That's that's Ooh. amazing, Mr. Avatar Yaya. What's going on, fellas? Your how you guys doing? Here. It shocks me that Yaya got with the program before Down Bad and Blank did. That's what I'm saying. So, first, it, first of all, Ohio. these motherfuckers have been yesterday. these motherfuckers have been on the podcast numerous times now. I'm just like, nah, I don't feel like turning on a camera. Yaya shows up unannounced, did not plan to be in the podcast, but then he was just like, oh, we turn it on cams, oh for sure. He turned his cool. motherfucker on. Well, them so, dogs be loose in my house. Uh huh. So. <laughs> I can get them dogs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I gotta get it together. When I get they gonna dogs, eat your I'm camera though. They gonna yeah, eat the camera though. Yeah, they gonna eat the camera. You yeah. yeah. gonna need they, something for the court case. Uh, you gotta yeah. train them Pokemon's, man. Tell them not to use bite. He got something. Yeah, I'm trying. On. I'm trying to get the little the, the Pokeballs or dog houses, whatever it is, to something to keep them locked up, so they, they don't cause a lot of. Rock. You talking about chains? Hold on. Yeah, okay, like I'm a little confused. Was he talking about his titties or was his actual dogs? Because I I assumed he meant his titties, and I was like, is this man saying he needs a bra? Like, I just I meant, I meant whatever you want me to mean. Whoa, don't talk whatever to me like funniest. that. Whoa. Don't don't flirt with me like that, sir. We are gonna make me act up. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> huh? Huh? I I could take you there. Get to sleep, sir. All you had to do is say that one time. All right. Uh, anyway, so we got a couple of questions for the beginning of today's podcast. We only have a few. Uh, Darth actually asked uh, a couple from two weeks ago, so we're going to use a couple of those. First question is, is being horny a sin on the timeline? No. no. Wait, did I ask that? Yes, you did. Huh? Yes, you did. That when? Was you. That was you. He asked it in a credit horny. That was all you. Yeah. I got, the, I got the receipts right here. All of them. I loaded be- up. I got well, the receipts. It's weird to be horny from the times yes. of 10 a.m. to like 6 p.m. There's a particular after, after that. See, what? because like, like all right, let me let me explain, right? Because okay. like if I'm like, let for example, everybody know notes. we got a homie. Uh huh. I know Jay know who we're talking about. I don't know that be retweeting stuff throughout <laughs> the day. Uh, I ain't gonna say no names. But I my, have a few but, homies that do that, actually. But yeah. my ex-girlfriend was like, what are you looking at? I was like, listen, I'm looking at research for videos. I have to blind shit. Like, I'm looking at research for videos. You just got to soar past it. I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> like, I'm playing, like, get this shit out of here. <laughs> yeah. So, I don't care if you're being horny on me. Just not early in the day. Okay. After 6 o'clock, go crazy. So, after <laughs> d- when demon time starts... <laughs> That's what it you is. You pull that thing out. Right, yes. right, right, right. So you so say are, so are you saying that you 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 don't like the retweet that you be seeing from the person? No, I like the retweet. You... I like the oh, retweet. Okay. He okay. made sure but to like it. I just don't want people to know that I'm also liking them in the broad daylight. You you know it's a such thing as bookmarks, right, my brother? That that, that ain't nobody got time for all that. I can hit Man, like it's, it's, or it's make another Twitter. You click the three dots and you click bookmark and you have it saved. Yes, sir. Bro, I ain't finna look for no three dots when I see three titties in my face. Like I'm not finna do that. Three titties. <laughs> why, yes. is an, why is it an odd number? So does, I don't know. Does somebody have two, and another one have one, or is it a Martian? Look, somebody got point, a deformity. <laughs> a Martian. The point is, I don't really care. Right. Just not in the so, morning. According to Yaya, you can't be horny during business hours. Right, mm. right, 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 right. If the That's bank true. is open, you cannot be horny. <laughs> <If> the <laughs> bank is open, you cannot. You legally cannot be horny. So, Listen. so what about national holidays? Are those are those free pass because the bank closed? Hmm. What about on Sunday? Chick Fil A closed. One hundred percent. That's the Lord's day. So, yeah, that's, that's the Lord. Listen, I'm uh, so, I'm gonna do. Hold on. The Lord gave me this morning. I'm about to look up one thing. I'm about to see if he's right about this. Hold on. Let me go to likes. Bro, what if, Bro. So what if you wake up at 10 a.m. and you just you just insert the? <laughs> I know. Honestly. <laughs> Somebody was horny on. Somebody was horny during I ain't gonna lie. I be down. I don't even be caring. Like sometimes I just be like, oh. That's a nice boob, and I just like it. And I'd be like, dang, Twitter show singular. that. Singular. Again, singular? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got one good titty. So let I'm me ask you a question. The so the lady with three titties, was she supposed to help the lady with one titty? Is that was 
They they knew each other on the TL. They got her fumes and make oh another God, one. I don't know. That poor woman. She gonna have four titties. So they ain't got no type of business arrangement. Like you no, know, you know like how I know y'all see it like the only. I be getting mad as hell. I ain't gonna lie to you. Like when OnlyFans like we post. Oh, uh, they post the Twitter pictures and they put the flower over to like the. I ain't gonna get into that. That be pissing me off though. I be uh, like, look, uh, you're not gonna preview me with a with a, a hard preview. What you say? You want me to? You, you, you say what now? I don't want it to. I, I will pay. I don't care. You don't like that flower? What's this man? This no, man that, that flower not it, bro. They be off to the side. They be off to the side like this, and they got like a little, a little flower right there, bro. Like, no, bro, that be pissing me off. I don't know nothing about this. You informing me on something. You are an educational purpose. No, sir. I definitely see. No, sir. I don't know what you are talking about. They're like my only fan is five ninety nine. Yeah, we are fifty percent off. Right. This is a flower. No, sir. I'm a man of God. I'm a man of God. I don't know nothing about this. Nothing at no, all. No, I gotta be a botanist. Oh, that's a petunia. That's a petunia. <laughs> I see some tulips. Uh, I see the tulips. <laughs> did this did this corny bitch just put a daisy on here? Oh no, she better act like she got some class. Um uh, <laughs> Yeah, man, you know be, what? I'm gonna really tell you right now. When... Nah, go ahead, DJ. What you got? You want me to go? You want me to go? It'd be real crazy. Sir, clean up. They be posting the stuff on Instagram. Like the stuff that can go on Instagram, they be they be posting this OnlyFans content. But that's, no. just, that's just wild. No. no, thank you. I don't, yeah, I'm not airing it out. But if what we share on Instagram and that group chat is what you got on your OnlyFans, you need to step it up. Yeah, honestly. What, 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 hello? What we share on Instagram and that group chat? It's a it's a group chat that's that you're not a part your of. Yeah, yeah, yeah honestly, you, that's you, above you your pay grade, bro. We tried to tell you. <laughs> okay. We tried so to I tell you. Hey man, you listen, I'm gonna I'm I'm be honest with you. You ain't getting that promotion. That ain't happening. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't happening. He was like, I'm the only, I'm the only real nigga in this. <laughs> I'm going to tell you right <laughs> now. It's not it's coming. Not it's happening. not coming. You can put in all the overtime you want. It's not coming. It's not Man, happening. just smack me so. up in my mouth. Okay. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, we already packed your stuff Call up. Call an ambulance! Let's... Call an ambulance! <laughs> but not oh for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, listen, man, I'm cool. I'm cool with people being horny on the timeline. I'm cool with it, obviously. Yeah. Um, what I don't like is how Twitter outs me and my likes to other people. <laughs> you know, I can understand if I'm retweeting some shit, you know, because I want to share that. I don't want to share my likes. I don't no, understand I why it. Twitter just I think it's a good it. idea. Like, oh, scrolling past, a, oh, that's a titty and a half. Uh, you know who might like what? this? What? Avatar Yaya. And then I click like, but I don't send it to him. I'm supposed to bookmark it for later. So that way I know to send it to him. Yaya, I seen this bitch with one and a half titty. I knew you would love this. Send it. So, uh, so for my likes to just be randomly popping up and showing up, because I'll have people like, leaving replies in threads that I have liked intending to go back to later, which is why I liked it. And uh, all of a sudden, damn, Jay, this is the stuff you like? Hold up. You're not going to expose me. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Ooh, 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 ooh. Twitter got me all the way fucked up. So I had to make a whole separate account just for being horny. And uh, honestly, every time I step on that account, I hate it. They're just be, mm. they're just be too much. There'll be too much. Okay, and uh, I really feel like a lot of my social media time definitely goes towards Twitter because of not safe for work content. I think I would spend more time on Instagram if there was like a link feature instead of like swiping up. Like, you know, when somebody put yeah. a post and you yeah. put a link on there, it doesn't work. So, you know, and I also think, you know, I've said it time and time again, Instagram needs a not safe for work section for sure. hundred percent. Without a it's shadow of a doubt, way more prominent on Twitter. Like they used to be running rampant. Oh they man, yo, I've post- seen entire yeah. entire porn parody movies. Okay, I've seen the 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 Pole Avengers. Yeah, that shit is heat. I love uh-huh. that one. Uh huh. Uh huh. Um, <laughs> Who played Black like Widow? I don't know. I don't know the young lady's name. I don't know. Oh, her. Okay. okay. I don't know. Sorry. So- Sophie D. Yikes. Hello? Okay. Lena Paul. Huh? Uh, anyway, <laughs> there's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with being horny all the time. But I think, I think uh, on a platform like Twitter, though, I think sometimes we gotta relax a little bit. And uh, yeah, Yaya's right. I do know a couple of people that do be uh, they be doing some dubious things at eight o'clock in the morning, and I'm just like, yo, 
you got to you can't, you got to be kidding me. I actually don't like that now that I think about it. I really I'm not with it. I'm not with it. You got to slow the horny down at 8 a.m. If you're horny at 8 a.m., you need to go see somebody. You you need to go get some help. I'm going to pray for you're, you. I'm going right. to pray for you. You're you're allowed to be horny when the bar is open, but you got to stop when the bar is closed. Mm. Yes, sir. I mean, yes, sir. I may need to see a therapist then. Oh, 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 we knew you needed I, to see a therapist. Yeah, we, you got yeah. to see somebody else. Man, you ain't getting a promotion and you need a therapist. You really yeah. down bad. Yeah. How did I you really, get this I, job? You see the name? You see the name? <laughs> DJ, I, I had to name? tell you. I really had to tell you this, but you were the diversity hire because of your mental handicap. Obviously. Wow. Oh, <laughs> yeah, we going to have to edit that one out. What the <laughs> fuck? No. Did you not learn anything? No, sir. <laughs> you Nothing see, so look, what? it was Jay. Look, it was him. I told you. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you right now, man. I had nothing to do with you being hired. Okay, I I swear to you, whatever, so the government contract, whatever, right? whatever so conversations. And listen, whatever conversations happened outside before you got here, they just said they just gave me your application. They put it on my desk. They said, "This is who we think should have the spot." We're not really sure. We could have gone with a white person. Could have. That was an option. A white person mm -hmm. was picked. But they said, you know what? You sure? I think I think we need a little bit of color. Uh yeah. And then Plank also said he wanted a Latino, but for some reason Deacon was like, "Why would I? Why would we <laughs> fuck up the demographic?" And I, we I got looked at him. Already. I, we he, got two. Yeah, I was I was I was just looking, and I was thinking, I was like, "Huh, that's a good point." I don't think I don't think we need no more Latinos on the podcast. No, that's cool. We good. We good. So it you know. But um, yeah, man, being uh being horny on the timeline is a sin. Absolutely a sin. I think you should burn in the deepest, Ooh. darkest parts of hell for that. So, uh, let me see. Uh, somebody asked about. I don't know anything about this Winter Soldier and Black America. Um, I'm not watching the show. I watched the first episode and uh, I was like, okay, I'll, I'll catch up to it later. Is anybody else watching it? Uh, yeah. I'm watching it. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm waiting on. I'm waiting on tomorrow, bro. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They, 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 they for for some this show. Hit for me because they doing a lot of like black representation in there that you don't get from anywhere else in like the MCU. It's like very like real stuff, mm. <laughs> like real. It's not just like, hey, this happened last week. Let's throw this into a Marvel movie. It's like right generational stuff being talked about. I saw I saw that one episode where Don Cheadle showed up. I said, oh, this is what we doing, huh? <laughs> like, this is what we doing. We throwing all the black people in the same show. I said, God rest Chad Chadwick's soul, man. They would have tried to put him in here. Mm -hmm. He would have definitely been in there. Yeah, he I definitely would I think there was would've. a point where he could have showed up, too. But I'm not finna spoil it for people that Yeah. Been, so. Nah, go ahead and spoil it. Some of us not watching it. Mm. Well, I mean, well, just yeah, how about you refrain? Is, you like, did this yesterday, DJ. Hey, this last I, time. I mean, no, I just... I, <laughs> Every week, DJ <laughs> comes on this podcast <laughs> and he just spoils the show. Era? Every bro, single no week. Way, uh, there ain't, there ain't no way you just did anyway. this. <laughs> you sitting there laughing silently. <laughs> what, what's going on? Quiet. Errol, just be quiet. <laughs> we're, we're trying to record the podcast with Arrow right now, please. Yeah. <laughs> that is crazy. You know, ladies and gentlemen, we got a very special guest. My man, Aaron H. What's going on, brother? How you doing? <laughs> I actually, hold on, hold on. Hold on. we're just going to switch topics real quick. We're going to we gonna switch topics Errol. real quick. I, I had a question. Uh -oh. mm -hmm. um, okay. <clears throat> does your girlfriend... Season grilled cheese. What? <laughs> I just, you know, I, I just want to ask. Go ahead. Go I just ahead. wanted to ask. Go ahead. Does she season <laughs> grilled cheese? This is. I think I it's a. Know this too. I, I think it's a pretty simple. We gonna give some context in a minute, but I just want to know. I just. Does she like if she made a grilled cheese? Do you think she would season it? Yes or no? There's no wrong oh, answer, okay. by the way. There's no wrong <laughs> answer. I just. <laughs> I just want to tell you. I, let me take some pressure okay, up. There's look, look. no wrong answer. Okay, it's fine. Something, I've been something known happened to throw in my stream today there. where somebody said something, and we need to know. You date a white woman? Yes. Okay, so, all right. So, we need to know. If she were to go ahead, I'm talking about the whole full grilled cheese process, right? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking mm -hmm. about she lay that cheese on that bread. She put that bread in the oven. She let that boy cook up real good. So, mm -hmm. it's like nice and crispy. Does she or does she not? Seasoned it before she put it in the oven. We talk about the bread and the cheese. 
Do we put grilled cheese in the oven? Y'all put that in the oven? Oven? In the oven? In the oven? What the fuck is wrong with you? Yes, sir. I don't put that in the oven. Oh, my. I in the oven, bro. All right, pause on the... Oh, yeah, We got to call the police. We got to fight Jake Paul. We got to fight Jake Paul. We know who's next. We know who Jake Paul is fighting next. So y'all be doing... Y'all doing it in the skillet. Yes. 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 I, yes. First of all, first of all, you I gotta stand there and watch it, bro. No, sir. No, sir. I am a man of culture. I put mine in the air fryer. I put mine in the air fryer. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I, I put mine in the motherfucking air fryer. <laughs> oh, the all ring right, is made for you. All right. So, but all right. So, do, you put the grill. He put his. <laughs> Yo. The, okay. First of all. You make the crew time. time. Yo, I'm just DJ. I want to let you know right now. You definitely getting fired after this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> you definitely getting oh, fired. Shit. We had multiple people. Plank probably getting fired too, honestly. But he just been here. You Wait, know what? Plank got a dynasty Plank, hire, Plank so got, he just a write up. Yeah, that's trying to. We we basically gotta uh, vote him out because you know you he's man, got a. You give, you give he's me, a partner. You give me a, a five minute intermission. I'll turn the camera. Five minutes. This man said. Five minutes. He minute. said, "I gotta put. put he gotta put his bra on. Gotta, come on. Get his dog away, bro. Hey, come on. Yeah, come on. You, know, you ever try to? You ever try to put a, a woman's bra back on? That is the most challenging <laughs> shit, bro. I swear to think, God. Taking it off is easy. Minutes? You just pinch. You just pinch and flick, and that's it. Boop. Gone. That's it. <laughs> try to put that motherfucker back on. Why you think I'm asking you for? Love you, bitch. Oh my God. Anyway, so. Uh, no, I just wanted to ask because uh, DJ was having a conversation earlier in his lo in his stream about uh, mm -hmm. seasoning grilled cheese. That's why it didn't have nothing uh -huh. to do with the fact that she was white. I'm, <laughs> oh, it, it, all right, I'm gonna say something reckless. Never mind. Gotta get it back. It's, 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 it's a completely fine. That, it's an urban legend that white people don't season food. So yeah, yes, yeah, when you see something, it's like she kind of like. Salt and pepper is it though. She came Most from the, the land of like not seasoning food and then she found the slap your mama and now she just throwing it on everything. Like she could put it <laughs> on water if she, on. if she wanted to. Hold on. I, I have here. questions. Ow. I have questions. She what? said questions? the what? what? The seasoning she used is slap your mama. I'm not joking. I think I've seen For that before somewhere. You never, you never heard of slap your mama? Bro, y'all gotta be tweaking. That's not real. Bro, like, nah. you see, I'm, I'm, I'm never going in the door and being like, hey, yo, I'm never going to get your mama. Where they? Oh, check it, check it right now. Check it out right now. I don't, I don't have that shit right now, but that shit slaps, literally. It's, no, it's bro. Literally, it's a real season. It's real. That's that's real. Real. That's, that's, I will be good. so embarrassed. It is, it is real. Like, it hey, yo, it is real. Where yeah. slap your mama at? It's Come on, this, bro. Oh, it's on Amazon. No. Put some slap your mama on it. Hey, you making grilled cheese? Put some slap your mama on it. Put some slap your mama on it. She did it. She did that. Holy oh, you shit. made grilled cheese, bitch? Did you slap why your mom you, on it? Yeah, why would you ever do <laughs> that? Did you slap your mama? Okay, all right. It's just good. To make sure. I can tell you that much. Oh, you look good. You, nice. Like that's why I asked. Like, did she? Did she season? No, she doesn't. Before. She doesn't season fucking grilled I'm cheese. Telling, I'm because telling you, no. Now, it's like real flavor now I have like, a follow-up question. Uh -huh. If she were to season <laughs> grilled cheese, what seasoning yes. do you think she would use? Probably black pepper. Throw some cayenne in there. <laughs> just like I said, there's no wrong answer. I was just, I, was just, I, I, I don't season my grilled cheese because I'm not, I'm right. not weird. I don't season my grilled cheese. Nah, nah. Right. I don't the season the bread is already weird. seasoned. You put the, in the, air <laughs> the bread is already, I think that's the weirdest you can ever get. Put Yo, it in the I air gotta try, I gotta try it. Yo, go put that shit, go put that shit in the air fryer. Oh, go make it, go take you two but two pieces of bread, put some cheese oh, in there, no. put that mother, oh, oh you can't God. put that shit. Oh. It cooks on both sides, it cooks on both sides. Just pow. That's it. Melts the All cheese right, so inside. Bro, come on. Come we're going to get the verdict of the air fryer grilled cheese. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. Fungus. Is he actually yeah. about to go do that? Yeah, of no, course he is. Like Y'all, you about that. He really about to go do it. I am liking his little nook setup, though. That's cool. That's cool. That is cool. Yeah, I'm really proud of it. Okay, hold on. Let me pull up the, the other questions real quick. Hold on. In the meantime. Yeah, I don't think I don't think my crazy ass would season. I think really about to rob somebody. Oh, my God. Yeah, he really is. Huh? Playing just doing doing it different, <laughs> doing it different. So, but uh, yeah, I don't think I don't think my goofy ass would season no uh, no grilled cheese or anything like that. So you know, but uh, let me see. Plank, why are you always in a bat cave? Because <laughs> you live in a cave, bro. Bro, he in the basement. What are you? Yeah, I, I, I can't. What you put the bucket hat on for? 
Cause he said, I had, to I had to flex in the dark real quick type B. Like, I, let me let him know. Hey, you got the you got the Barbie shades on too, bro. I see. These are the cloud goggles. Come on, Barbie. Let's go party. Oh, they're the cloud yeah, those, goggles. Those are, those are the goggles from season one I of Digimon. Yeah, no, I can't see. I can't see nothing. So, um, let me see. Another person says, how do you deal with burnout? Oh, that's a pretty good one. You pretty don't. good game. Pretty good game. Um, <laughs> didn't age well. Didn't didn't age well. Didn't did not age well. No, no did no. not. I was playing it yesterday with a. Uh... Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I'm gonna I'm be quiet. I'm a... Black men don't cheat. <laughs> Black men don't cheat. Yes, sir. Black men do not cheat. Um, you kind of just gotta take some time for yourself, even though it seems counterproductive. Like uh -huh. when when you're at a point where you're already burning out, you're just like trying to grind probably way too much and you just neglect yourself and that's where it comes from, in my opinion. Just take some time for yourself. Uh -huh. It's either that or you worried a lot about what other people think. Put your titties away and turn your camera on. I'm about to. It's away. I don't believe you. I don't believe you at all. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, burn you out. Don't believe me what? You know what? I'm sick of this. You you don't believe me what? I'm sick of being you don't believe me what? Hmm? This man had to make sure hmm? he put on a t shirt. Listen. Is that right, he put on a collared shirt? Yes, that sir. Afro Junior? Yeah, that's Afro <laughs> Junior. <laughs> Yo No, this is the real Afro now. The other one cut his uh, his fro that's Afro me? Senior. Yeah, I'm I'm the that's I'm Afro the Senior that, I'm the one that rises from the ashes. <laughs> he cut his hair, so I'm gonna be the phoenix that rides from the ass. Oh I, I, man! I said it and took a drink. Hearing Jay say it back, I almost let him spit that shit out. <laughs> I just, I, I can't believe it, man. I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. He came on the podcast day one. He said, "Oh, we shooting? Hold on. <laughs> he didn't. Shooting? He don't know who nobody was. He just said, "I'm gonna hit that nigga right there." <laughs> Ricky. <laughs> <Bro>. <laughs> Oh, shit. All right. Anyway, we're going to move on to the next question. Um, yeah. So dealing with burnout specifically for me, I don't know how to deal with that shit. I really don't. I'm still brand new to it. Um, I burned out when Jay I walk, get up from my bed to the fucking kitchen. Jay still so, burned out from 2017. I really am. Yeah. I'm real. That was a tough year for me, man. That was real. In between 2017 and 2018, that was a rough motherfucking year. It just. Uh -uh. <laughs> I thought you were going to say something dumb shit like, between 2017 and now, it's been a real tough Honestly, season. from 1992 to about <laughs> right now, <laughs> wow. rough it's, year it's really been, you know, pretty rocky, if I had to say. Like, you know, 2 out of 10 would not do again. Not at all. Yeah, I, no. Sometimes, I do, I'm not going to lie, this sounds a little depressing, but sometimes when I hop in an Uber, I'd be like, please let this be the last ride I ever take in my entire life. Just, just this like, man just drive me off a cliff or yes, something. Yes, sir. And then the insurance can take care of everything. You know, that's it. That's they put me in that four thousand dollar box in the dirt. That's it. It's over. I'm about to buy me a twenty dollar backpack. Let's go. So, <laughs> yeah, it's a it's a rechargeable yeah, backpack. Yeah, uh, it's a, no, it's a rechargeable really. backpack. It's, he said it's almost done. It only take about three minutes. I that's know. the beauty of it. It only take did about you, three did minutes. Did you put Slack your mama on? I don't got no slap your mama. Oh, <laughs> Didn't even know what that was till like five minutes ago. I just want to say for, this man. is the goofiest looking set of people for a podcast. <laughs> 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 I've never seen so many cartoon characters in one place. Hey, man. <laughs> so, so not only am I disrespectful for being called the janitor, now I'm a cartoon character. I'm you even yes, cartoon. yes, hundred percent, hundred percent. Everybody got to sit up now. Everybody got to pretend to be. Everybody got to pretend to be professional and shit. I didn't know they were shooting like this. <laughs> <laughs> now you, you can shoot. I get shot at every week. Hey, so I don't, this is, I don't Yo, your Discord is toxic. Your yeah, Discord is very toxic. Yes, sir. How is it toxic? We was trying to talk about black history yesterday. Them niggas was just like, get over slavery. I was like, whoa, wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> well, hello? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. It was weird. You did it on stream, too. <laughs> All right. Yeah. No, 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 no. All right, you got to explain it to me. You got to explain it to me. I don't think, I don't. When when we were in the uh, in the chat or whatever and we were talking, I was saying stuff that I I didn't know. Like I, I didn't oh. have any information on. Oh, so okay. He like get over. Nah, it. I, I don't know. I like, thought I heard what he. I thought I heard homie in the in the in the chat go. Yeah, nah. get over slavery or something like that. I said nah. what? See, he nah he he, he, wild. Nah, he white too. He white too. So it would have been Ooh. a huge problem. It had that had that when, listen. Hey, <laughs> this is problematic. Ooh. 
That's your My Discord is a little toxic. That's your homie. I mean, at least you don't have a, an entire Discord of people photoshopping your head on Pop Smoke. That's, there were two new wow. posts. I would rather have that than a toxic. There were two new posts on the subreddit, and I, they were from Lee Boy. So I, you know I feel like from. I feel like when I get to the other side, Pop Smoke gonna want to have. He gonna want five minutes. He gonna take his shot. Yeah, he really is. <laughs> oh, so you like it when you? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> you uh, like it when you like it uh, when people uh, yeah. Photoshop your face uh, onto my body, huh? Huh? You trying to be me? You wanna meet the woo? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what the <laughs> fuck is this? What's up? I'm looking at the subreddit. Yeah. This is the most disrespectful. Oh, hold on, I'm gonna put it on uh, on the on the recording for people. This the is the only most other disrespectful. That I have seen work harder than Lee Boy with with stuff that Jay has like content that he has put out is a SoundCloud rapper. That's the only one. That's it. That I, I think that's the only people. way. The honestly, only that's crazy because Lee Boy about to make a SoundCloud mixtape based off of Jay. Yeah, pretty much, and it's literally just voice recordings of me saying such shit and just. Yep. That's gay. Over, over an instrumental. That's over gay. an instrument. Over a pop smoke instrumental. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so and that's gonna be blowing the back so. out. <laughs> blowing the back Yo. out. Yikes. All right. Uh, we got one more. <laughs> uh, let's see. Personal opinions on Bad Baby turning eighteen and the Doctor Phil <laughs> Ranch speculation. I'm That's glad crazy. you had a finish to that question because my opinion about her turning 18, I was just about to just let y'all. You know you people, was plotting. People age. You know you was plotting. Don't act like you weren't. We know you. We know you like the snow bunnies. Dude, the way this man is shaking his head. Good lord. Uh -uh. I could never. Um, listen, man. Listen. I, Errol, what? I'm just saying. What did you say? I'm just saying, you know, she's she adorable. You can never. She a cute, she, she a cute little, you know, eighteen year old or whatever. That's cool. That don't got nothing to do. What did what did LTG say? Uh, he <laughs> said, yeah, she, LTG? "Yes, sir." Oh my god, <laughs> LTG is my hero, low key, man. Every time he says something toxic, I'd be like, "That's right." Yeah, that's right. So you agree with the gang of wolves? This, this motherfucker said on stream. He said, "You can't even call bitches bitches no more." I said, "What?" He said, they take that as a compliment. He said, I may be a bitch, but I'm getting a bag. I'm a bitch getting a bag. I said, uh, okay. Uh, I don't... I couldn't understand him. My, my tiny beta male brain was trying to calculate what he was saying. He said, you can't call a bitch no, a bitch no more because a bitch is getting a bag. I said, what does that mean? What, what does that even mean? What you word did you not understand? understand that I don't... I mean, it sounded like, sound like he wanted to be offensive. But he can't be offended. But yeah, that's what I'm saying. And I was like, so did you prefer when you could call women bitches or just bitches bitches? Because this is LTG we talking about. Are we that's what I'm saying. See, it was it was a deeper meaning to it, and I knew it was. <laughs> y'all looking at me crazy. Y'all yeah, yeah. y'all just really just like this thing. Scientifically, figure out what LTG of all people was trying to get across to you. Yes. Yes. I am an LTG believer. Thank you. Oh, Thank you, sir. He Thank is you. not missed. He is not missed. <laughs> he does not miss. He, he truly does doesn't. Miss. He doesn't at so, all. Nah, man. And then I was bro. watching him. Uh, I was watching him talk about uh, you know, these bitches with OnlyFans and all this other stuff. I said I was a little confused. I was like, does he not, uh, you know, appreciate that women are are using coochie to get to get money? And he said no because. Uh, you know, it's making these women think that they're successful out here. And that, uh, I, I, I just, I, I forget what else he said. I'm, hold on, I'm paraphrasing. He said some of these women believe that they can get, make a career off of selling a coochie on the internet for five ninety nine. And I said, I don't really, I don't really have a problem with it. Uh, <laughs> of course. Pull up the OnlyFans. Yeah, I mean. I, it, it's been done, so I mean, ain't no belief. Somebody didn't did it. I mean, honestly, not, hoeing is the oldest profession in, in the history of ever. Yeah. yeah. Yes, but just like content creation, everyone not built for that. Mm -hmm. Some people physically not built to be selling coochie. But there are still out there that will... Yeah. What do you mean, but? But there's an exception the for every... Yeah, well, I mean, Jay's here right now. Don't Just use his name. Come on. Huh? What? <laughs> 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 I, I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. I was looking at Joe Exotic getting ready to get out of prison. I'm, I'm confused. What? Is it, is it clear? Can... It's clear. It's clear. Okay. Uh... Uh, I hate this podcast so much. If you guys are, if you guys have made it this far into the podcast, make sure to rate it five stars on iTunes and uh, follow us on Spotify. That'd be greatly appreciated. This is the worst. This is the worst podcast ever.
we, we better than last week's. Yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely. Yo, it's better than last night's. Last what? night's was was a little uh, sus, man. It was a little sus. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Having um uh, having a situation, I guess I could say, right? Let me pick my words wisely because yeah, you might want to think about this real quick. Yeah, you know what? Let me not even say that. Did y'all know that Joe Exotic <laughs> was trying to? He was trying to get uh, Carol Baskin to help him get out of prison. Did y'all know that? Why? Are any of you guys no. familiar with the Tiger King, by the way? Yeah. 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 Phenomenon of 2019 and 2020. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes, that's right, man. That that man has been trying to get out of prison because of, apparently Carol Baskin has advocated for him to finally get out. He has been in prison for about 22 years. Wait, he's no, he's in prison for 22 years. He's only served two years. Uh, for an attempted murder and a failed murder plot against her, so um, mm. I don't know how we feel about that. This is this is obviously filler shit. We really don't care. Uh, I personally don't. I think I just uh, need to know the mental behind. If if some if somebody tried to kill you, why are you like we could let them out now? Um, you know what? Chase, Chase n- in the bag. Niggas fuck up. Niggas fuck up. Let's be real. Niggas fuck That's up all the time. I mean, Joe Exotic is one of the a, most a mad niggerish white people is- I've ever seen. That's a spelling mistake is what you're talking about, sir. He's trying to kill it. <laughs> no, I... Yeah, but listen, he did it, was a, it, you know? It was a mistake. All right, listen. it's decent. Oh, hey. Oh, he actually hey. fucked. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is that in the oven? In the air fryer, yeah. Oh, an air fryer. Okay. In the air fryer. Yes, oven. Sir. Look at that. Look uh, at that delicious... That boy in the oven. I'm God you. damn. Oh, my Lord. Run it in the oven. <laughs> we just... You gotta do it. Cast, it I'm not putting it in no oven. Bro, but you gonna put it in the air fryer. Air fryer just a glorified microwave. I don't feel bad. Do you microwave? Am I wrong? Do you microwave? Yeah. Wrong. yeah. yeah. Sir, do no, you you're very your wrong. Grilled cheese? How? No. How do so you why microwave you put it in an air fryer? Because it's Wait, a what? it's a small convection oven. That's what an yeah, air yeah, fryer it, is. It's been wonderful so having you here. But it but it but it microwave. works like a microwave though. I don't gotta wait. But that doesn't make it a microwave. That makes it more no, 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 of an no, 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 oven no, no, no. with a microwave if it timer. Like on a it. microwave. Put it in the microwave. Let me pull another. Put another one. No, in because a microwave does not, not toast. You go. It's, it's gonna make toast. it fucking soft. That's why I said it's a glorified <laughs> microwave because at least it toasts and stuff it's, when I put it in there. No, it's a but it's it's a miniature oven. No, it's a miniature oven. What are you talking about? So it's a miniature convection oven with a, with a I'm micro not, with a microwave setting. But this is this is fat. Okay, I, I just want to see Deacon Lee. I'm, I'm <laughs> <laughs> for, for real though. It's a it's, it's you know it's a, it's an oven. But like I'm not gonna put it in the actual oven because it ain't gonna it's gonna take longer. I don't got time for that. Because you have to it's wait like, for the oven to preheat. Right. I ain't got time for that, man. I want my sandwich. Why are you putting the cheese on the bread? That the oven could be preheating. Bro, you know it's how long. It how long? No, no. How long does it take you <laughs> to put cheese on bread? How long? <laughs> you know, full I mean, oven does not preheat that fast. Take. It could take an hour if I wanted to. If I want to cut every more you want cheese, cheese. You can yes. hour for you a take cheese. an hour for a you grilled cheese. If I want it, if I want <laughs> nigga, you might as well make a pizza from scratch. Are you DJ? Are you a fucking DJ? Yo, the joke. I'll say it like this. I would rather make a grilled cheese with a hair fryer or a hair dryer than, hair a, fucking, fryer. than a, a fucking fryer? oven. I would rather make a grilled cheese with my hot breath, okay, and just <laughs> <sighs> breathe on it the whole time. Then put it in the oven. Yes. Yeah. That probably would be faster, honestly. You y'all different. You're the only one to put it in the oven. What the, no, okay, I'll be different, but until y'all try it. Well, I you wrap that shit in foil, too? You wrap that shit in foil? We used to do that. <laughs> well, no, no, when I put it in the oven, this is how far I'll go. This is how far I'll go. I'll make one in a in a convection oven, not an actual oven. I'll give you Why that. Why not put it in the actual oven? You you cheating. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm gi- I am giving you, this you, man the benefit of the doubt. DJ, oh, all I know God. is you better not own You're a motherfucking genius. toaster. You better not. I, I, if I find Me? out you own a toaster, yes. Why you need a toaster? Put it in the oven. Yeah. I put it in the oven. So how do you make waffles? I put in it in the oven. oven. Do- Wait, huh? <laughs> no, 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 no. What did you no, just no, say? No, 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 no he waffles, didn't just say that. You throw the waffles. Did, listen, you get a little just... tray. You throw the, throw the waffles on the tray, and then bam, you got the waffles. <laughs> this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't 
think I can do this. Anymore. So is that how you make your pancakes too? You put them in the oven? No, I don't. I don't. I don't. No, I don't know. Is that how you make your you breakfast items? Bacon, bacon you're you're gold. one sentence. You were one sentence away oh, from me from connecting you from the Pancakes go on, on the skillet. Bro. That's they, they go on the skillet. Oh. So pancakes go oh. on the skillet. Bro, y'all can't. But now you're grilled cheese. With your face. Oh on, man. And your face is in your hands. First if it you was slap your mama. Now it's try waffles. To, try oven. To, no, first of all. That the slap your mom wasn't me. That that wasn't me. But I'm just saying, until y'all try something in the oven, I'm not trying here. How do you make your pizza? How do you make your pizza? How do you make your pizza? Just you put that shit in the skillet. Don't tell me use a poster, bro. <laughs> <laughs> There's another way to make pizza other than the oven. Uh He's right, yeah. You want to try that air fryer for everything? Oh, Sorry, I'm rich. I got a stone. Can... I got a stove oven. Stone stove oh, oven. That's pizza what I got. stone, <laughs> yeah. A pizza stove. That's what I got. Sorry, I'm rich. I got a whole. I got a whole wall dedicated to just crafting pizza. Sorry. Excuse me. Hey, bro. Look, you put a, you put waffles in the toaster. Sometimes they be a little hard. You know what I'm saying? I'm. You put I'm them honestly. In the oven on the right temperature, you watch them and they fluff up a little bit. That's they crazy. Be, they be the, I'm they be honestly the shocked. Between, I just have a straight waffle maker. Right. Oh you, do? oh, you. My my you... panini press is a waffle maker. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, just... I'm not. I'm not that fancy. I'm, I'm gonna need a bar that press by part, the end. Part of me, Jay. Part of me expected. You want me to show you? You want me to show you? I go part get of me it. Expected, part of me expected DJ when he said, when you said, we do you have to go get our, our like, actual waffle meat. Yeah. I just turn my toaster to the side, put the cheese on, put the bread in. <laughs> <laughs> that is ingenious, though. That is that is brilliant. That is I've brilliant. It, I've done it before, and it works. I just don't fuck with the toasters that when you put them in there, and then the little metal the metal pieces oh, clatter. Yeah, because yeah, then if you turn it sideways and you try to put them in there, they, the metal part touches the cheese, and I just don't, I just don't be fucking with that. But. I mean, do you, brother? Do you? That's crazy. You know, whatever. Can we, can we, it's wild. Can we turn this to the culinary podcast? Yeah, honestly, bro, we should just before, come out here every before, week and just uh, talk about food. Before next That's week, y'all got to throw, throw that thing in the Oh, I'm not doing, I'm not doing that. My oven. No, I'm not doing yeah, that. Sorry, sorry. I'm not waiting yeah. an hour to, to make a grilled cheese. No, thanks. No. Because if I'm doing yeah. that, I'm making a pizza. Right. <laughs> I'm not making a grilled cheese. If I'm turning I'm on the oven. I'm literally every other thing else. If, if, yeah. I, if I am doing anything with the oven, it is definitely not. To just squander my oven on a fucking grilled cheese? It's not even grilled at that point. You're not I'd grilling. Just make brown lemon. You're not. You are not even grilling it. It's just the cheese. I don't know what to tell you. What Sir, I got gas. What did I say? What did I say? I said I'm brown not. lemonade. In the oven. In the. Brown the... Lemonade. No, not the brown lemonade. <laughs> Arrow, not the. <laughs> not the brown lemonade. Don't do it. 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 <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> Yo, what's up with y'all in the oven, bro? <laughs> don't, 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 don't try to put it on me like I'm the slow one. You were <laughs> sitting there in the middle of the oven conversation. What else you putting up? What is brown lemonade? Oh, you don't know the story. Don't, so. don't. What? Now, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> did, did your girl do this? Did she do no, this? no, no, no. This I is, know. She's original. been trying. I know I she's been trying to correct him on this. I know. I did this. I know. No, he said, hey, baby, you ever have brown lemonade? She probably looked at him. The fuck did you ask me? <laughs> the fuck did you so just when ask me? So when I was living in the apartment, right, I wanted to make some lemonade. That's a classic. But we didn't have any, like, like regular sugar. We only had brown sugar. So, like, I filled it up with uh, one cup, filled it up with water, put that lemon in there, put the brown sugar in there, stir it up. Greatest lemonade I ever had, but it was brown because of brown sugar. You said it was the greatest. Greatest. DJ, I know that, what's that going boy, through your head. Boy no, that I know what's going through your head. That boy lying. For, no, first thing wrong, he greatest. made a singular cup of lemonade and not a whole pitcher. Singular. He said, I'm not looking out for nobody. <laughs> nah. Second thing <laughs> wrong, this man thought he even the, One. the thought crossed his mind Uno. that he used brown sugar. And that's it. That's everything wrong. All that's I heard it. the first time he told me this was this was this was part of a struggle meal. This was yeah, part yeah. of a struggle that's meal. That's it. It was. That's when you <laughs> make hot dogs in the in the in the in the yep. in the beans. You know what I mean? You yeah, take yeah, you take yeah. the baked beans. Yeah. You put them in a pot. You cut up your hot dogs and you throw your hot dogs in there. Okay, yeah. cool. Uh-huh. Or you make it hot dogs and you boil your hot dogs and you just mm-hmm. use regular bread instead of hot dog yeah. buns. I get it. Yep. I get it. You know, sugar sandwiches, grandma allowances. I get it. I understand. Yeah. I'm with it. So, but when you told me brown sugar, I said, I know this can't be right. 
I know the two <laughs> things do <laughs> not mix. <laughs> That oh, don't even shit. sound like it tastes good. It, it, it tastes great. Brown sugar and lemons. Lemons, brother. All right. All right. Have you tried it though? I'm not, never going to try oh, it. Look, y'all gotta stop that. Have you tried it, brother? All right, Errol. You, you know what, Errol? I got you. I'm gonna make me a cup of brown lemonade and an oven grilled cheese. You See know what? what okay. All right. So since we're doing a food challenge, since we're doing food challenges this week, um, I, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need y'all to go ahead and do it. Uh, what? you ever have a I'll Hawaiian Hawaiian barbecue pizza? Oh, that's good. That's no, I no. have that. Yeah, I've, had I've that. never See, had that. Now, now I know some of y'all may think this is blasphemous, but go mm-hmm. ahead and get you some ham, get you some bacon if you choose. You know, you can have both. Uh, I prefer to put sausages. Uh, when you're making a pizza, and instead of using regular tomato sauce, you use barbecue sauce. Okay, sprinkle two different types of cheeses on that motherfucker, and then add pineapples. And tell me it's not the greatest thing you have ever had in your entire life. Why are you looking like that? Why are you looking like that? Why are you looking like that, Yaya? Why are you looking like that? As if you ain't never messed up the masterpiece, bro. All right, you go ahead and tell me. Pineapples belong on pizza. Pineapples do belong on pizza. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. do. I'll be back next year. You are playing ass face, but you don't understand. I know the man. I know this man is not talking about what goes on what and hey, you use I the agree. oven for grilled cheese just yeah, for grilled really cheese right. no just for right. cheese. using an oven for a grilled cheese is not worse than putting pineapple no no it's, we're not saying it's worse it's just that like why you don't you have do the room to talk <laughs> why do it? It? I'm, I'm talking right now okay i will say you make a grilled cheese with tomato on it no that shit is delicious you should definitely try that shit grilled cheese with tomato Yes, he probably like only cheese on his grilled cheese. He don't get adventures. Hey man, listen. All right. Nah, I will throw some ham on that thing. Other than that, I, I do that. But it's not a grilled right. cheese. Yeah, that's no longer. That's, that's just a sandwich. Ham. That's it's his ham sandwich. It's a ham sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> so at what point did the did the ham overpower the cheese? That's what I want to know. Yeah. How much ham did know. you put on there? I don't. It, fill on, fill on. It was it cheese on, featuring ham? It's a grilled cheese featuring ham. It was the ham had to come first. The ham, yeah. yeah. Ham, ham. Ham, ham is dominant. Like, meat is dominant. Yeah. Oh, obviously. Well, actually, you know what? Yeah. We do have something in chat. That's a fucking melt. That's not a grilled cheese. That's a ham melt. They don't know what they're talking hey, about. Hey, Panini, don't you be <laughs> a meanie. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, this is the worst podcast ever. Guys, make sure to rate this five stars, please. We we need real jobs. This is not going to work. Because... <laughs> We over here have no idea what the fuck to talk oh, about yeah. anymore. This is crazy. No, but I'm serious. Oh, Definitely, if you give, if you, uh, if you ever get a chance, try and put a put some tomato on it. It's real good. I promise you. I promise you. Oh, it's like, cheese. it's um. If we have a tomato. Have you ever one, had? Though. Have you ever had a? Uh, it's called the after school special. It is a grilled cheese, a sprite, and you take a uh, tomato sauce and you dip your grilled cheese in the tomato. In the I tomato feel sauce. for just listening to this. You know, no? tomato I mean, sauce. You mean ketchup? I've, you could use oh, ketchup, but ketchup is not the same as tomato, tomato sauce. sauce. Is different tomato than ketchup. It's way different than ketchup. It's ketchup not, has a lot of sugar in there. Yeah, and it's like yeah. it's it's the consistency is different too. It's like having a uh, soup and grilled cheese. Uh huh. You know what I mean? Sense. Like they they go when hand you, in when hand. When you put your grilled cheese in the oven, I'll put a tomato on mine. I'm gonna do it this week. For I sure. got you. I'll try it out. Nah, no, I don't think that's not that's not the bargain. I'm no, I'm good. You gonna put pineapple on your pizza? You gonna put pineapples on your barbecue pizza? That's what the fuck you gonna do? You won't so. put it in an oven. So what? I gotta put pineapples on the pizza. I gotta get an oven first. Sorry. <laughs> I don't. I don't own that. Yeah. Toast for oven counts. Don't count. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's unfortunate. So, uh, unfortunate. but let's go ahead and get I'll into. Try, I'll try a slice of a Hawaiian barbecue pizza though. Hey, there you go. Make sure there's no. I mean, I personally, this is my combination. Hold on. Let me pull up Domino's real quick. Let me tell you. My I can't cook, so I'm just gonna have to order that shit. So. That oh, shit I'm is delicious. It too, so I, yeah. I'm not cooking it. All right, so this I'm is what I usually get. This hard. I can't own, cook bro. pizza. <laughs> the the hard. Hard. Me, like, what well, is I mean, I mean, I, the dough part is the like, like it's making the hardest scratch. part. But it's just it activated yeast and flour. But it, it is also the most fun part to do because when I used to work at the the pizza place last year, man, that shit making pizza was just dope. I loved it. I forget. I, I forget. Love. Jake, it's thirty-seven jobs a year. Yeah, <laughs> basically. You know what's interesting is like la- between last year and this year, I've only had two jobs. 
Two. Damn. That's the lowest I've ever had in the history of me working, period, at all. So, I think half the world closed. Weren't you a Power Ranger at one point? You about to be a Power Ranger this Sunday, right? Saturday? Oh, yeah. You're not supposed to say nothing, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, edit that out. Oh no! Oh, what T'Challa though? Uh, anyway, you know, uh, yeah, I do, I do, I do, I do have a, I do have a T'Challa cosplay coming up. So there's, there's a couple, couple people got, got some stuff that they want to put me in. You know, no big deal. Just King of Wakanda. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no flex, no flex, no big deal. So you know, hold on, I'm about to make this pizza real quick. So the, uh, the one that I get, this is what I get. This is what I usually get. Um. You know, I usually get a. Green, right? I could, I could, but I want to describe it to you. Instead of using tomato sauce, I have them put honey barbecue sauce as the mm-hmm. as the base, right? Extra thick dough, garlic crusted, premium Always. grilled chicken, double cheese, pineapple with barbecue sauce swirled on top. And That's a little too I'm, much. And if I'm feeling frisky, I'll have them add bacon, little bacon bits on top, or sliced ham. Sliced ham gets a little, eh, gets a little iffy because it collides with the chicken. So, but yeah. the bacon doesn't. It complements chicken. It's, oh, it's delicious. Anyway, I have a food direction now. So let's go ahead and talk about shit that we actually <laughs> wanted to talk about this week. Um, let me see. Uh, let me pull this up. So uh, we didn't get a get, we didn't get a real chance to talk about this, but the PlayStation Store is no longer closing. The PS3, PSP, PS Vita shops. Oh, no uh, longer closing. Uh, PS, no PSP is still closing. It's Vita and three that are staying open. Vita and three that are staying open, which means, but you can buy PSP games on the for the Vita. So that's yeah. I wonder how that that loophole works. That's gonna how be do, weird. How do we feel about this backpedal? Uh, I feel like it was intentional. Like it... <laughs> I feel like I Sony was like, we need to make some money. Let's make artificial inflation, say it's going to close, see how much we get, and make the decision from there. You think they did that on purpose? I think they did it on purpose. I feel like they were actually going to close, and then people were like, oh, don't do that. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> just don't do it. Or, but is I, it feel, really I feel like easy? they should. Well, they obviously just did it. Well, I, but, but we don't know if that's really the case, though, because I think it's more so what Deacon said. It's just, yeah, because it's just server costs to keep those stores open, and they ain't paying shit for servers. They're making way. Like, is it really that easy to get a whole company to change, just change their mind? Like, it's not the whole company, it's one division. What, yeah. Well, okay. Well, one division? That, that division of. One division is mid. Um, yeah, you know what? I think it's, I think it's a combination of, uh, the online, like, presence and yammering of people, and also people, you know, personally, which I don't, I don't, I don't think people should do this. Uh, threatening the president of uh, of PlayStation, uh, Jim Ryan. Mm-hmm. People were just like, "We will pull up on your house because I can't buy my PlayStation Three games." Well, because okay, the way they case, did it I was weird. See why they, they a little no, because the way they did it was weird. Because they set a date and then they moved the date up to you know happen even sooner, and then they took it away. Yeah, that was that What's was weird. Big backpedal. They said I by mean, summer. If, if you get in depth threats, you can't tell how serious somebody is about you know because you ain't trying to. You're not about to get a whole division like security and all that hey stuff. Hey man, planks people are crazy. That's all I gotta say. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'd be riding on a mugger hat. Then people will run wild. I don't know. They storm capitals and stuff mean? like that. Oh, I'm, <clears throat> uh, they obviously saw the backlash. I just wanted like, I can't go out with like losing third strike. Cause oh, yeah. that's the that that's uh, the best version the of best that one. game. That's the best version of that game and like. They ain't gonna port it or nothing. Like at least tell these companies, hey yo, port these games or something. Like they don't want do y'all want money? Like <laughs> yeah, the PS three is a nightmare for ports. Yeah, it was yep. a nightmare yeah. to develop on, it was a nightmare to port anything from. Yeah. So how does that wonder how that, Yeah, I wonder how that works with uh with digital goods. Because I can understand developing for that specific hardware, but now you're only dealing with software because you're no longer dealing with disc. So if you have uh, an entire library of PlayStation 3 games, should you not be able to play that on a piece of hardware that can run literally anything three times the, you know, well, play, like the, yeah, it, the intensity, basically. It, it depends on, on how they developed it because uh, PS3 had like this fucking ass backwards language that it had to use, and then PS4... I know they made it more accessible for developers, so you're gonna have to change a lot of like the back end stuff to get it to run on this hardware. And even then, you don't, it's not optimized for it. I'm still but, sure it would be, you know, this day and age, we have the technolo- technology, we could just replicate that, couldn't we? 
Yeah, is I mean, that not definitely the same good. thing as a PS Now too. Like, uh, no, no, that's that's different. That's, no, I, that's, that's streaming I, and emulation of a game. Yeah. yeah. So not only are you emulating the original version, which is what the PlayStation Four does with a lot of its uh, remasters, uh, mm. at least with like the ones that they have, like the Ratchet and Clank one and the Jack and Daxter one, they use emulators. But whereas the PS3 version, they're remasters. So they're actually like going in and like upgrading the game, upscaling it, making sure frame rate is proper. But for some reason, yeah. they skipped over that when it came to the PlayStation 4 version. So, so let's, let's use The Last of Us as an example. Porting The Last of Us from PS3 to PS4, that's a smart move because if you didn't have a PS3, you, you know, you're hard pressed to find it. Uh, PS4 to PS5 remastered, that's just wanting to get sales because porting a game from the four to the five should be fairly easy. It's still the same language, it's still relatively the same environment. It's just yep. hardware changes. Yeah, because I, I understand it being a remake, uh, though. So uh, no, like, that's different. That's yeah, different. that's completely remake is different. different. Remake is completely different yeah. because that's building from the um, ground up. Again. Yeah, I think it's going to be a whole different game. I don't even think it's going to be Joel and Ellie, and if it is, it's going to be like based on their yeah. HBO series. Like that's, I was even talking about that in a video. That's that's such a no brainer. Like especially when you put hand in hand with a TV series coming out, it's like The Walking Dead show and The Walking Dead game, even though they're mm -hmm. two completely different storylines and then there's also the official walking dead game that is based on the show which sucks uh you still get that hype and that momentum mm -hmm. from this walking dead title so yep. I, you know could use, I, the, could use yakuza for like the remasters versus the remakes remasters is like yakuza kiwami they just took the game and they made it nice Re or no remasters is yakuza kiwami they rebuilt the game from the bottom up the the yakuza 3 4 and 5 are just uh remasters they just ported them over they didn't change anything. Yeah, so it's a huge, huge jump between one mm -hmm. and the other. But I think when it comes to digital goods, it shouldn't be that tough, especially uh, with a dedicated team. Software patches and stuff like that should be able to do it. Because once again, it's all software. You no longer have to deal with hardware. I can understand yeah. the, the PS2 being able to run PS1 games. That makes sense. Yeah, we're still yeah. using CDs. Yeah, that makes yeah. sense. PS3, uh, well, that takes whole dedicated half hardware. Half. Yeah, we can, we can do it on the first one. The first one, yeah, we can fit it in this elephant-sized motherfucker. Sure, of course. Uh, the second and third series PS3s, no, absolutely not. We can't do it. That's a hardware issue. They but, took that hardware out. Yeah, and especially, you know what's interesting? They need to implement something like, uh, I, I think Xbox has it, where you put the disc in, and your console will recognize what the disc is, what game it is, and be able to play it if it's on an acceptable platform. Like, if I have Crash Bandicoot from the PlayStation 1, which I still have, like, you know the the fucking binders with disc in them. I have yep. <laughs> four Crash Bandicoot games. I should be able to put that in my PS5 and my PS5 be able to read it because that that's is, a CD disc now. That so, is a physical media. Yeah, exactly. So if I put a PS3 game in there, it should be able to read that based off of how advanced the software is now because I not just software, but hardware too. So it should yeah. be able to do that. That's Blu-ray. That's bl Going backwards should be easier now than ever before because it can read CD, it can read DVD, and it can read Blu-ray. So I need I need some excuse uh, to be made because none of this shit makes any sense to me. Should be able to play it. Like, should be able to play it. That's it. Should be, yeah. But, you know. Or even if they do uh, digital upgrades. Say you put the disc in. And it gives you an offer, you know, you go to the PlayStation store and they're like, oh, we recognize this disc. It's going to be like $5. $5 to, for a digital enhanced edition Love of the game it, you're trying yeah. to play. So they'll upscale it to, fuck, just upscale it to 720 Just stretch that motherfucker. That's it. I, I don't think. What was the reason and why they took that that type of hardware out of, like, the PS3s or whatever? When it, Cut or cost. When it yeah, it yep. made it way too expensive. Oh, okay. It was $600 at lunch, remember? Yeah. So. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah. Which Yikes. Fucking yeah, insane. I forgot about that actually. Yeah, I know, because you didn't buy one. We know. Well, no, I did. I you, did. Bought, you bought one of the hefty bitches? Yeah. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. Yeah, I, I still have it. I still have it. I, it. I remember telling my dad, my dad asked, do you want the PlayStation 3? I said, no, I'm good. I still got a PS2, and it works perfectly fine. Thank you. Yeah. I wish I would have kept it. So, you know. Hey. That's uh, very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. What else we got this week? Uh, we got some Spider-Man news. That look, that's what it looked like. With some Spider-Man. Yeah, some Spider-Man leaks. Um, don't nobody really care. I mean, nah. we've already pretty much figured out that Spider-Man 3 is going to be uh, live action uh, Spider-Verse. How are we feeling about that? 
I well, think I'm gonna get a Tobey Maguire Spider-Man tattoo on my ass. Nice, nice. Bro. Man of culture. I yeah, like for real. Yeah. I'm an Andrew Garfield hater, so. You don't have the hands out, like, coming out near the hole? Like, You're not going Yeah. Thank oh God, God Super Jet is in here. People not think he's better than like, Andrew Garfield, Garfield, but I can't, I can't get behind that. I think Tom Holland is the best Spider-Man. I think I Tom Holland is the best. I, 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 I personally like him a lot, man. He still gives me off that geeky, nerdy Peter Parker vibe, but also he's a very funny, hilarious, just quippy Spider-Man. I think I think he's great. So yeah, he's ripped too. Yeah, he's Wait, fucking what? cut. Like, like my, cut, what do you yeah, mean like by that? Her? So so what do you mean by that? How, how did you find that out? Yeah, you don't. He did the thing for the Nathan Drake. Like you, you don't remember the picture for? No, no, no. That's Nathan Drake. How, what you know about Spider Man? How you know about Spider Man with his shirt off? That's what you said, right? But he takes his shirt off. You said in the he. Movie. You said he looks good naked. Is that what you said? Yeah. What's up? That's did what I like heard. Yeah. You like the way it hang? <laughs> sus. A little sus. Now Nathan Drake yeah, on the other hand. Crazy out of context. Nathan but. Drake <laughs> on the other hand, sir. You, got we, no, you, you just kind of threw that out there, like. <laughs> what? Yes, sir. You don't want your Spider-Man to be muscular? <laughs> DJ, you need to get in the gym. <laughs> First of all. He said, I don't I got nothing up for the shoot. <laughs> I love it. Oh, so he what? said, so he so said, I'm back to the mind. corner. <laughs> so, so, I can, so I can turn my camera Y'all ganging on up on me. Look at me like you looking at Tom Holland. That's oh, what my God. Yo, that actually That's what what baby. Shit. Yo, they gave me a headache. This podcast really just going to turn into us roasting each other. He said, this podcast is really going to turn us into uh, just roasting each other every week. God damn. So, all right. I got one more thing, and then we can go ahead and get out of here. Um, I had a question regarding Genshin Impact and uh, free-to-play games. Um, I'm sure Avatar Yaya would like to have this conversation with me. Oh, man, he's dead uh, already. Yeah, he's, he's going. I got Genshin up right now. Um, not just Genshin, but uh, I was having this conversation. Um, I think we were having it, what, maybe a month ago? And we were talking about Shinobi Striker being free-to-play or something like that. Um, do you guys feel like free to play games are really uh, like games as a service really are kind of <laughs> kind of fucking up the industry? What do you guys? How do you guys feel about that? Uh, yes, mm, yes. Mm, no. He said I that with passion. To say inherently it depends on the play. game. Okay, yeah. let me say this. It depends on the game, but overall, they're affecting a lot of shit. And it's like people are like hyped for things now, and then like two or three years later. They complain about the things that they were hype about because other games are doing it. Like, example, <laughs> Genshin Impact being on console. Mm -hmm. Now all these anime mobile games want to go to console. No, just one. Everybody... Just one. Just one. It, it, it's fine. No, well, just it's a the rumor one. that, like, My Hero and stuff is coming. Oh, shit. That's bad. Fate, all that's game coming. Game. Yo, if we can get yeah. Dokkan on console? That game is actually <laughs> Okay, Dokkan would be kind of hype on, on Yo, PS4. Yo, Dokkan, yeah. Oh, he had to pull out the game. Yeah. Yeah, that's a flex. What? That's a fucking, flex. yeah. How, no how is it a flex? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't, don't have $70. Yeah, no. I'm broke. <laughs> like, I don't have a PS5. Like, oh, okay. oh, he got two. Oh, you got two. You just got $140 just laying around on your desk. I only access to the PS5. Okay, well, DJ, you're getting jumped after this. So. Yeah, for sure. For sure. <laughs> I don't, I've never, Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! I, didn't, I didn't even pay. I paid half price on my PS5. Uh, Online. Yeah, right. huh? I, I the PS5 is that. real? <laughs> I, I don't know anybody with a PS5. Go get it. Go get it. Show us it's real. Nah, it's you got to show me. I'm Proof of life. Huh? <laughs> he got to show me. He don't got it. He got it under the desk. You Why got a PS5? Why is it under the desk? Because I don't... I, I have dust know. issues. You got dust issues so you put it underneath your desk? Yes. You mean to tell so me you got a thousand dollar? You got a thousand dollar console. You just go. A PC right there. Wow. I, I gotta clean. I want to be able to. I have the dust. I, I, it's over there. But like, if I get up and I'm like, oh, it's Tuesday. Time to make sure it's clean. Make sure the vents is. I can do it all right here. Like, <laughs> yeah, you got this shit on a bath schedule, bro. I hate seeing dust. You know. As oh, you hate so, my desk. So yeah, I'll probably fight you. I'll probably fight you and clean it for you. So you will be mad at me for beating you up, but your desk will be clean. So don't That's be mad. Just like, you win the fight. Hold on. I don't gotta win the fight. Somebody going with a scar. That's my rule. <laughs> Growing up, my grandparents was like, "Look, if you lose a fight, please make it look like you didn't lose a fight. Because if, if you look like you lost a fight, I gotta whoop you now." So 
Some you gotta come out with some battle damage. If my, you get your ass yeah. beat, I'm beating it again. My mom, right. my mom used to say that too. But I used to win my fights, so I, don't, I never had to worry yeah, about that. I'm cool. Exactly. Worry about, yeah. I'm, I'm too big to lose. Yeah, nah. I nah, hear that. So. Uh, but uh, let me see. Uh, what was what were you saying? You were saying about uh, Genshin Impact like, in anime games. But I feel like, okay, a lot of people complain about like you know everybody's been complaining about microtransactions forever, and yeah. then like they'll get mad at one type of company for doing it for like like for let's put it for example fighting games. Yeah. A lot of people hate paying for DLC characters right for some reason, but they'll drop twenty five dollars for a Fortnite skin. Yes, Fortnite is free, but the problem here is that. It's free and it's gonna exploit you to spend more money than the game costs overall. You most likely, if you're a big fan of those type of games, you're gonna probably spend more money than you would buying it like a normal like seasons pass and stuff with it. Mm -hmm. I have a friend that spent at least like he was like, "Oh, fighting game DLC sucks," and I look at his League of Legends card and he has like two thousand dollars spent in it. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like it's it's like some hypocrisy there, and then it's like when things get bad, you know, like. People get upset about it, and I'm just like, you a part of the problem, though. No. You know, I feel like I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you something right now because like they're 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 paying for something that should be there. You know, kind I'm gonna of. tell you something right now. You know who complains about that shit? Broke niggas, broke niggas, broke niggas love complaining about paying for shit. All right, right. you gonna tell me you gonna spend you gonna spend right. how much money on shit you don't need in your house? On shit you don't need in your life, but you and ain't not gonna spend uh, ninety nine cents on Angry Birds for an extra power up. But you've been no, playing hours angry. and hours of it. You know what I mean, like Angry Birds. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, I'm just using that as an example. Where you living? I'm just using that as an example. Living like ten years ago. I'm starting to see that, Jay. Yeah, I'm, I'm like just saying. Man. I listen. I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm on the fence about it because I can't say anything. I spent uh, ten dollars on Genshin Impact the other day just because I wanted two specific items, right? But I'm also somebody who spent five hundred dollars in one month on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle because I was like, yo, I already play this game at least nine to ten hours a day for five years and i've never spent a dime until last year and i was like you mean to tell me i've spent hundreds of hours in this game and i can't give a dollar i can't give ten dollars i can't do this i can't do that you know what i mean i've genuinely spent a lot of time investing into this game that i believe is fun and then next thing you know super saiyan 4 gogeta comes out and i'm like well this is, I, this is my favorite character. I have to get him. I have to. So I, you know, I, I don't even play. I don't even play fighters like that. And I bought Gogeta on my PS4. I bought him on PC, and I bought him on. Uh, what? Hold no, on. yeah, just on the both platforms that I don't play the game on. Because I wanted to play that character. So, but then again, I'm rich, bro. So, you know, you're rich, bro. Rich, bro. <laughs> rich, bro. Okay. Broke, we're living rich. All right. So I don't really, I don't, exactly. I don't have a, but has fighters not been very entertaining to play? Yep. I don't so know. The last I'm, time we played, we played you weren't very entertaining. No, I wasn't. I don't like getting my ass whooped in the street. Debatable. I don't like getting my ass whooped and, and bullied and nah, nah. That's I'm uh, cool. Why would anyone do that, bro? Yeah, that's that's very Shut unfortunate. Up. And you know what? This leads me to another conversation. Then we're going to go back. Yeah. <laughs> I have was having this conversation, and I really think some of you, you fighting game niggas got it mixed up. I really think y'all be complaining about shit, not talking about, oh, y'all be talking about, oh, well, our series isn't popular or a lot of people don't get into fighting okay. games. Well, when you got motherfuckers like Arrow and motherfuckers hey, I, like Plank beating people up, I'm uninstalling the game. I don't want to play no more. Listen, listen. The game is not fun. So I'm not going to spend money on it. I'm not going to go to events. Nah, nah. It's not casual, friend. It's not casual. Nah, nah. I got to stomp it. You're not going to learn anything if I take it. You sound like that Paul got TikTok. Nah, I'm not I'm not there to learn. No. But like the thing is. I'm going to take a class if I felt like taking a class. Here's the thing about fighting games that a lot of people have messed up. Okay, you tell me you, how I feel. Go ahead. Go ahead. You, no, no, no. You're, you're, you're valid for feeling the way you feel. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying you're wrong. You're feeling right? Cause valid. Because okay. believe me. <laughs> believe me. <laughs> validated I was, I was validated like a parking way. ticket. Gotcha. I was like the same way started. on the 64 my uncle kept whooping me with, with Pikachu. Oh, yeah. I was the same way. I was really bad. But the thing about fighting games is that when you play them, you're not instantly supposed to be like, oh, yeah, I know how to play like Sonic Fox. I'm going to fuck niggas up. Like, no, that's not how it works. 
you supposed to play fighting games the way you play everything else. And it's the <laughs> big misconception like, nah. dang, he doing a TOD on me. Nah. I want to turn the system off. Forget that thing, bro. Nope. You're not supposed to play him like that. Nah, nah, You're just supposed nah. to play so them. What you, so what, what I'm hearing from you way. is that I need to not play with these two individuals. That's what I'm yeah. Yes, that's yeah. what you need yeah. to not yeah. do. Yeah. All right. well, we so, knew that already, yeah. though. Yeah, I, we did. We knew that already. I don't know what's going on All, I, I'm, I'm, all I'm saying listen, is you have to realize... It's easy to realize, the, pay attention to the temperament of the average human being. We're not talking about me who will gladly take an ass whooping from his homies because we're just cracking jokes the whole time. You think I give a fuck about mashing a few buttons with the homies? Bruh, I don't give a yeah, fuck. Yeah. That should get me in my feelings for about 10 minutes. I'd be like, you want to play some Apex? I'm tired of playing this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but you also have to, when these games are made, you have to understand that if... If it's for the average person, if you're trying to get as many people to play this game as possible, that learning curve is going to have to be there. It has to be changed. And that that's something that you have to do offline. I don't think that's something you can do with player interactions because then we get into the to the talk of like toxicity and all this other shit. And it's just impossible. It becomes impossible to do at that point. So I oh, that other grilled cheese ready, huh? Like I'm yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> I, heard, I heard. I got the same one. I got the same one. That's how oh I knew. That's how I knew. That, that's why so. they put stuff like uh, auto combos though in uh in fighters. Like, I think they need to put a warning label. On. Oh, warning. Yeah, put a warning, a warning, warning label. label. Yeah, you know how like games have you know warnings for mature. This man, is that a chicken ring? Oh my god. <laughs> Him and his chicken, him and his chicken rings. <laughs> um, I think I think you need to have you know some more. I don't think you should be allowed to play online without a certain number of hours played into the game already. You gotta uh, first. Yeah, I don't think I don't think because Street one. Fighter tried to do that with Street Fighter Four Arrow. Remember they were like they they set a cap. I think it was like the first you had to go through the tutorial or something. Yeah, for like two but hours. Like, that's the tutorial though. That that it's telling you how the game works. You don't just Bro. go online and then to try to warm. press random buttons. You're like, why can't I do anything? Because do you didn't anything. go into the tutorial. Hey, you, didn't, you don't know anything. So you need to learn like the basics of the game first. So you can actually actually so, do something. Let me ask you. if you Would you not make those instructions and those tutorials super simplistic for people yes. who aren't? So people can actually get into the game and right. play faster. Right. Yes. Now, Fighters does a very good job of that. But yeah, games like Street Fighter, Marvel vs. Mm-hmm. Capcom didn't do it very well. Uh, yeah. Tekken. A lot of Tekken. Tekken, do, Tekken, Tekken no in these 38 buttons. Like, you throwing up gang <laughs> signs and no shit, tutorial. bro. Like, no. Tekken is... Tekken will have you Here's fucking carpal tunnel and arthritis. Like, nah. Here's the truth, though. <laughs> Tekken didn't even regardless have of, data until, like, last year. Regardless last if year, you be... Like a couple months. Regardless if you... They nerf the games or make them easier... The better player is still gonna win regardless. If you no, make no, it easier, that's not the problem. The better player is gonna have an easy time. To- that yeah, like, that's like- that's not the problem. the The problem is is when you're creating these games and adjusting, uh, trying to figure out what the learning curve should be, because right. then then you you alienate people from starting. We're just talking about offline. We're not even talking about online right now. We're talking right. about like if I'm playing the game and and because I remember. What Tekken game was that where I was getting beat by the fucking final boss all the fucking time? Five? The kept, yeah, Tekken. I, it was either Tekken 5 or Tekken 4, one of those. I think and the motherfucker the, the, kept the flipping. Big guy? Yeah, the, the big, big lizard guy? motherfucker. Yeah. Six, yeah, six, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that motherfucker was flipping all over the place. I was like, I got to figure out how to beat this bitch. Like, that was something that was that was easier to, to deal with. But when it came to online play, you know, I was just mashing buttons, getting W's, you know, no big mm-hmm. deal. But I was like that when um, I first fought Jim Pachi. And Tekken. Tekken yeah, five. Just, yeah, Tekken five. Nah, nah. That boy a demon. Shit. He, he, was, he was whooping on me, bro. That's 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 sus. That's sus. All I'm saying is it the the learning curves needs to be developed differently because the average mm-hmm. person does not have the temperament to deal with these games. And uh I, yep. I don't want to hear any more complaining from, from the fighting game community. I don't wanna hear it. I don't wanna hear it. Y'all got the worst community in the world anyway. Except for my <laughs> except for like my hero fans. I don't know about that. Oh, oh, the worst. No. Worst. No. Smash the players. Worst. Smash players are the worst. That's my bad. Smash players are the worst. But everybody can play our game. Uh, yeah, hey, but man. a lot of the people that play that game be touching kids. Yeah, if it's over 18, oh, maybe, we, they, oh, nah, no, we, we, we can't even say that, bro. <laughs> I don't know. It seemed, it seemed like it seemed like every week there's two things. There's every week there's two things I see on my timeline. Somebody who plays Smash Bros was touching a kid and a police shooting. That's it. Those are the only two things I ever see on my timeline. Okay. Sometimes it's the one story. I don't, 
a local police officer shoots child, find out you, he plays Smash Bros at home. That's all. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I hate That's it here. I hate yeah. it. <laughs> but anyway, let's get back to the conversation about free to play games. Um, I don't. I mean, I don't hate them. I don't. Yeah. I, I, I mean, you'll have something like Warframe, where it has at least 400 hours of content before, That's like like least. actual content, like playable yeah. things. Before you have to spend any amount of money. Now, when you see some of these other motherfuckers zipping and flying across the fucking yep. map, and they got like these these giant crowns and railments and stuff, crown. fucking oh, yeah. they're paying money. Oh, bro, <laughs> they're paying they pay money. Or yeah, they put motherfuckers time into the game. They sank eighty thousand dollars in their mom's house into this game. Okay, so I'm then a, I have a friend that has like four K hours on Warframe. Yeah, bro, that game yeah, is. Yeah, I don't he have four like, K. He just start. You just, just start just eight hundred. I'm like, bro, I don't want to play with you. Just eight hundred. Yeah, like, just, just a light eight hundred hours. Make me look broke. I'm good. <laughs> nah, man, nah. And I remember I, I went from from playing that game specifically, and I had like emailed the developers. I was like, hey, can I copy my my save from my PS4 to my PC? And they were like, yeah, that was a promotion we did last year, but you can't do it anymore. I said, you had a timed exclusive promotion for cross saves. Are you stupid? They were like, well, you could just not play the game. <laughs> and I was like, "All right then." I couldn't. I couldn't say anything. Like I was just like, "All right, yeah, I guess you got me." Like, you so got me. they told you, "Like we don't need you. We got homeboy. Yeah, eighty thousand. Exactly. We rich. Do? We don't need you." So as soon as I started playing the game, I was like, "I ha I already knew the things I had to spend money on." So I was like, "All right, I guess." Next thing you know, I put four hundred hours into it. Only spent like ten dollars, I think. So. You know, it's it's games like that that do it really well. I think Genshin Impact does it really well. They even have like the uh, what should we call it? The pity summon system, where like if you summon nine times, the tenth time you get a guaranteed thing, and that applies to all banners. So if you like do like some shitty banner nine times, and you're like, all right, cool, I got a bunch of weapons. Then you go to the banner that you want to get a character on. That tenth time, you're gonna get a guaranteed like feature drop, basically. So it's like um... that's a pretty decent pity system. Um, I think some of these I, I bring up Shinobi Strikers because I feel like that's a game that works perfectly with the free to play model because it the would, gameplay, it would be great. With yeah, the, the gameplay is mediocre. It so it's like, oh, OK, you know, it's like a little arcadey type of thing. And then if I want to buy any Kotsky cloak for two ninety nine, if I want to buy, you know, a scratched headband hat for ninety nine cents or a character for four ninety nine, it makes more sense in that type of game. And it's like it then becomes more pleasant because now the barrier to entry is gone and more people play it. So it's like the more people you have playing the game, the more potentially will purchase new items off of that game. I mean, the uh -huh. season passes are great too. Like you could still offer that, but. All right. Uh, so we talked about this before on Twitter. Now I agree. We we knew it, it makes me mad that Xenoverse Two went free to play before Shinobi Strikers did because they because Shinobi Strikers desperately needed it around season two. Now what the numbers is getting. It's getting as populated as Storm is, and which is kind of yeah. whack. But I think like, that's just yeah. a drought of Naruto. Yeah, it's content, just though. nobody's yeah. playing nothing else. So like, yeah, there's like no um, Naruto shit. Yeah. They would have to change how the shop works to do a free to play model. Yep. How and does it work right, now? In, okay, so in Shinobi Strikers, just by playing the game, you get different tiers of scrolls. Then mm -hmm. every like season. Or every like two months, you have this Ninja World League, and the higher you rank up, the higher scrolls you get to access some of the other items in the shop, which you can earn them for free. And I feel like knowing Bandai, if they made a free-to-play model, they're gonna rack the prices up on things outrageously. Mm. Which I, that's 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 whatever, right? Like a Kakashi cloak could be like six dollars compared to like. Oh, you can only drop 99 cents and get like hella scrolls and get the Akatsuki cloak and 10 other cosmetic pieces with it. Right. So like I'm with it. I'm I'm with I want more people playing Shinobi Strikers. My big problem with that, that game though, mm -hmm. is just they there's no private matchmaking. That's no, like the most there's not enough so players. Not enough players. I think if they had Ooh. a I, I mean they have you know a pretty good player base now, but I think it's only because yeah. they've consistently put out content and people are like, well, 
I mean, I guess, like, I guess. you know, when you see it, thing, it's the recent yeah, games, when so you see it on the TL, you kind of like, oh, that looked kind of cool, you know, you buy yeah. the game, you play it for for 15 minutes, then you turn it off, you know, and then next next time they, uh, you know, update it or they drop a new character, you play it another 15 minutes, and then you're like, oh, whatever. It's the same thing with me, Arrow, and Overwatch. We we play every every oh, seasonal, yeah, every seasonal event, we'd be like, oh, is this the one? Is this no, the one we come back? No, yeah. It's not. And we never come back. We never come back. Never come back. So, you know, I'm, I'd be very tempted. If, if any game deserves my money, it's definitely Overwatch. So, um, but I, 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 yeah, no, no. Rest in peace to my man, Jeff Kaplan. So, uh, yeah. you know, he's not dead. He's just not, he's just dead to me. Um, but anyway, <laughs> I see what you're saying. Yeah, the game would have to be, the game would have to be a, a, like exponentially uh, changed as far as like the how much grinding it takes to get something. So I don't know. I got the clubs. Don't talk to me. Yeah. I Destiny don't Two a... is the best game of all time. You say hey, what? Go. What about Outriders, man? That's a D killer right there. Yeah, that's the yeah. D two killer. That's you know interesting. That. That's interesting. You know, game was great though. Borderlands Three. That was that was that was, that was a great game. Was that was, was fun. It? It was, I mean, it was yeah, good enough. Too. It was. Yeah, well, it, I, I never got the walking gun, so I don't care. Yeah. No. Yeah, that yeah, was no. actually low key. Uh, I feel like I got finessed. That should have been a quest item. Honestly, yeah, it should have been super easy to get. So, um, but yeah, I don't think. Uh, where do we think they're going though? Do you think more games are going to turn into games as a service? Which, I, I mean, I guess, but probably it I seems mean, like I that's where so. the industry's headed. Most games are probably not, but I think there are going to be a lot more with like with the successes of Genshin Impact as well as other games, mm. other free to play games. I gotta I think not look a... at you while you're talking, cause I can't. I can't. Uh, <laughs> I gotta look like this. I gotta do this. Uh huh. Right. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm listening. I told you, Lil Lucas glasses. Bro, oh, what? what? <laughs> <laughs> that was so like, random. Bro. Where do you, those where are the, those you are the goggles from glasses? season one of you Digimon. Get them on you Amazon. Them respect. They're cloud mm. goggles, baby. Uh, Why would you buy those? I bought these in. Cause like, he was acting different with that stimmy. Oh yeah, no! Nah, I bought them in 2018. Oh, they're like ten bucks. Oh, were you going through something? Or no, I I okay. had a Galaxy Book. It's okay, bro. I I, I bought Kanye Stunner Shades a long time ago too. Yeah, I, I fell fine. victim just, to I'm, I, I fell victim to, to, to some I'm shit sorry. too. It's okay. It's fine. I'm so, sorry. Um, I oh, hope no. stuff doesn't doesn't oh. turn into. Hey! Everybody, go get a go get a costume. Hey, it's <laughs> hard to see. Anything. It's about that time. Everybody, gotta go get a costume. <laughs> Since Plank wanna act up, did his face reveal? Since Plank wanna act mask. up, hold on. The Great War Toby mask. I ain't got no costume, bro. <laughs> so I ain't got nothing. I ain't got no costume, man. I don't have a mask. I just have this. There we go. This shit hurts my face so fucking. I know. Much. I know, right? I don't like this. Oh either. my god. This shit gonna crush Deacon, my face. you're not gonna put it on your face. It's not Ain't getting no away. Yo, this man look like Dr. Facilier. What the fuck? This, this shit is what? Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Hold on. This is the goofiest podcast ever. We ain't never doing this again. We ain't never doing this shit again. No, sir. This is why we don't have so many people on the podcast. Is this man Arrow doing a full wardrobe? What is he uh, doing, he is. bro? Hold on. I can't see that motherfucker. We got to put on anime merch? Hold on. I can go put on some anime merch. This is, this is, I just want to take a screenshot of this. This, this is the most. In the closet, he got bags. Like, what is it? Yeah, he got, he got, he got all type of shit. I'm not on putting on that robe. It's too hot for that. I'm, I'm telling oh, you. Right. <laughs> I'm not mm -mm. putting that on. Mm -mm. This can't, this is just not right. DJ, you got to get one. This is why you get fired. I got a drill. This is why you get fired, bro. <laughs> got one. See, because he, he brought up the shit. glasses and I was like, let me go get the mask. Yeah, honestly. So. I shouldn't have did it. I learned my mistake. You know what? Yeah. I'll take it a step further. We got it. I got you. I got another one. I could go get it. Put the money in the bag, bro. What you gonna do? Drill me? Yo, your yeah. cat pulling up to the high uh -huh. too? Is that a half I'm wondering what the fuck Arrow got. I'm waiting for bro, Arrow to bro, come. What are you doing, bro? He he he, uh, he, he is something, getting bro. dressed. He he is yeah, exactly. getting, I feel like he running through the house. Where is my Ikotsky cloak? Exactly. Where is Yo, I have one those. Hold on, I'll be back. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> back this seat. is, this is, what are you supposed to be? Nah, hold on. He went well, to go get the, he, he oh man. 
<laughs> he came back here with his COVID mask and everything. He said, hold up, wait a minute. I see you. Who, who are you? Who am I? Yeah, who ridiculous. are you? Myself. Bitch. You broke You broke up in the closet for this? What the fuck? That's great. Yeah, you couldn't find the Akatsuki Club, could you? Nope. <laughs> I didn't think, so. think so. You know that shit in the garage. So. All right, I hate this man. That's the long. Yeah, I, I think this is it's crushing my face. All right. Um. Anyway, that's pretty much gonna be it for this episode of the podcast. Uh, this got real goofy and real out of control for absolutely no reason. I love it. I love it though. I fuck with it. I want to thank Avatar Yaya and Mr. Aaron H for coming on to today's podcast. And also, I would like to say thank you to the janitor for gracing us with his last appearance on the podcast. Uh, that was amazing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing, man. God you make it too it. easy. You got the best reactions. You make it too easy. Um, oh, my God. Yeah. So, anyway, if you guys enjoyed today's podcast, make sure to rate it five stars on iTunes. And also, make sure to hit the follow button on uh, on Spotify or any other forms of whatever the fuck you're listening to. I'm clearly burnt out. I'm tired. Uh, <laughs> you will find everybody's links to their profiles and all of their social medias down in the description. So that would be dope if you guys can go and do that. Um, also, if we get this uh, – I think we should do something special for the next podcast. Uh, it will be our – what episode? I think it's going to be our 10th episode together. Okay. I, think, I think we should do something real nice. What do you – I'm what with you it. Talk about I'm it? with it. Yeah. I mean – Yes, sir. It's been pretty – Pretty cool so far. Hold on, let me check. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This will be nine. Yeah, our next one is gonna be our tenth episode together. That's crazy. That is crazy. So we'll you have to come up with something. Let me know what I need to do. I'm gonna try some of that. You sir will not be here, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, we'll probably are do we something. Are we pulling out the I don't. Sorry, guys. I don't got none of those. Okay, it's toy time, clearly. All right, anyway, thank you guys for listening. This <laughs> Yo, has been the Canon Culture. <laughs> thank you guys so much for listening. This has been the Canon Culture oh, Podcast. We will catch you guys. Yeah, yeah, you missed it. You missed the whole thing. Oh, you playing oh, dress up now? Thing. Yeah, you Why did. Why is my camera fucked? That's very unfortunate. Yikes. What did you do? What did you put on? Oh, my Lord. He oh, really went and did it. Oh, he really went and did oh, it. they're over there. They're over there. Good game. This man, game. hold on. Since we flex in games, we're going to have to do this after the podcast. We can flex games after the podcast. Anyway, we want to thank <laughs> you guys for listening. This? We'll see you guys next week. Make sure to keep it canon.